Hi, Bob with Knives Town here. I'd like to do a review for you today on a, a knife sharpener. It's a, a pocket knife sharpener. It can be carried anywhere and it does a really uh, very good job on sharpening knives and this particular knife sharpener has the added benefit of being able to sharpen serrated knives. Uh, you can see it right here. This is the Gatco Diamond Triceps and, and it's just it's four and a half inches long. You can see it's just a uh, uh, you know, very small size. That's got that's a very lightweight. That's it's uh, what it is. Is it's a ceramic, um, a ceramic uh, middle piece that is uh, that has uh, monocrystalline diamonds on the surface of it. It's a diamond knife sharpener, and then these two uh, end pieces are made of rubber, and they're used uh, they're used in the sharpening process. And uh, I'd like to give you a little bit of a close up here and exactly how that works because it's. It's a, it's a unique system that they've designed here, and it uh, not only does it do knives, but it does other things as well, fish hooks and darts and uh, ice picks and things like that. Um, here's a little bit closer view of it. And if you can see here, uh, the bottoms of these rubber, these rubber uh, end pieces, you can see they, they're faceted, and they have different angles uh, on them there. And, and the purpose of that is so that you can you can put the put it down on the on the surface of something and hold it at a certain angle as 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 the knife is being sharpened. So you so you obtain a you obtain a consistent angle uh, on the uh, on the ceramic sharpening rod there. Uh, and also, it it makes a good stop so that you know it, it grips the surface because that's that's made of rubber there. Uh, it has the same same on both ends. And then of course there's a little chain here where you know you can you can wrap that and, and get a good grip as you're, as you're sharpening or you can uh, put it on a key ring or, or uh, you know a carabiner or something so that you don't lose it. Uh, but what I'd like to point out here though is um, this, this sharpener has uh, several different function surfaces built right into it. Uh, what I'm showing you here is, is just the flat surface and this is for sharpening, just, it's just like a sharpening steel. Uh, it can be used to sharpen uh, just regular, regular plain blade knives. Just, just uh, drawing the knife down and across that that surface like that, uh, and the the mono crystalline diamonds in, embedded in the surface of this ceramic rod here will will sharpen that blade. Uh, it also, like I said, sharpens serrations, and you've got large serrations and small serrations, and the this is designed to handle both. If you can see. Uh, being uh, th this corner here of the triangle, this is this is designed with a broad corner, if you can see that, and this this is made to sharpen uh, your your wide serration, your larger serration. Over here, this corner, as you can see, is more narrow, and that is what fits into the uh, to your smaller serrations and sharpens them. And then here you've got a couple of grooves uh, uh, in into the surface of it. And this is where uh, your other implements can be sharpened, such as a fish hook, can be drawn up and down in that groove, or in the larger groove you can sharpen uh, a darts or an uh, ice pick or uh, any other similar kind of uh, implement that you that you would need to sharpen uh, like that. So let me let me see if I can give you a little bit of a, a demonstration here, more of a better idea of what I'm talking about. It's it's really a handy tool, and and if you have to uh, if you have to do some field sharpening, uh, you know, this is this is quite possibly the way to go. Uh, I have uh, here a, a Camelus Cuda knife. Actually an interesting knife in its own right. Uh, it opens with a cam uh, button here, like that. Not an automatic, that's all manual opening, but it's uh, an interesting feature. Maybe I'll do a video on this knife. But anyway, um, the reason I chose it was because, as you can see, uh, it has it has large and small serrations on the blade there, and that is, this this knife sharpener is perfect to to handle to handle that kind of that kind of situation. So let me just show you here exactly how that works. Try to get a little bit tighter shot. Okay. This is the narrow edge right here. This is the narrow side, and so what I'll be doing is I'll be using, I'll be sharpening one of the narrow serrations in this, 
So if I, I, that right there is one of the narrow serrations, if you can see that. It's kind of hard to show on the video, but, but I'm putting it like there, and, and that fits right in that serration. And that, that will sharpen that, that small serration just perfectly. Then we also have large serrations on this knife. And for that, I would use the, I would use the broad surface which is right here, this side here. And the broad surface, I think that shows up a little better there like that. You can see that a little bit better. So the broad surface can be sharpened in the, in the wide serration I mean, can be sharpened on the broad surface like this. And that will sharpen that the broad and the narrow. Okay. Here's a, just a regular buck knife. And I just I just use this just to demonstrate that it can also sharpen regular regular plain edge knives. And, and in, this, in this regard, it functions much like a sharpening steel. And you would, you would put, the, uh, put the rubber stop down right on, onto the angle you want there. And then you would just draw the knife. like a sharpening steel and that works perfectly there and that'll sharpen up your sharpen up your hunting knife I've also got here an ice pick and I'm just going to use that to demonstrate to you how to use the uh, the grooves in here and it would be the same thing for a dart as well I just happen to have an ice pick on, on my handy right here and you can see the ice pick now that fits right in that groove just perfectly. And that can be sharpened up and down like that. Kept at an angle, of course. Spin it. Now sharpen your sharpen your ice pick. That will work for a dart, and then if you can see, there is also another groove, uh, a smaller one, right next to the large one. This one right here, that smaller one, and that uh, that that is uh, useful for fish hooks as well. So so what you've got here is a you've really got a handy tool, if, and if for for an extremely modest price, uh, what what you have here is a knife sharpener that. It's diamond. It's 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 a diamond hone. It's very portable. Uh, it it's, it it comes with a chain, so it won't get lost. Uh, it it can sharpen uh, straight blade knives, serrated knives. It can sharpen uh, other implements, uh, and uh, you know, and it comes with a uh, set setting angles, and it's uh, really just a, a very good, uh, handy little handy little knife sharpener to have. Um, if, if I had to be, if I had to have uh, one field sharpener, uh, and I could only have the one, I, I would choose this. I would choose this one because uh, it's not going to limit me on the um, on the setting of the of the angle like so many of the the preset uh, sticks, the crock sticks do. Uh, they're preset at an angle. Uh, any angle can be chosen here. Plus, this will sharpen serrated knives, which no no crock stick will do. Um, and it's lightweight and travels easy. So it's a very good, very good handy little tool at a very modest price. So I can highly recommend it. Well, thanks for listening. We'll see you again.